Hey neighbors, do you remember that animated film, WALL-E? It was about a little robot whose job it was to clean the earth. Back then, I thought to myself, you know what? I want the WALL-E of my own. Back then, walang WALL-E. Meron lang wall But nowadays, we have this. Hey Google, let's clean up. Welcome to Next Upgrade, your ultimate guide to upgrading your home into a smart home. In this episode of Smart Home 101, you'll see why smart home cleaning devices are your next upgrade. Upgrading into a smart home means making your day-to-day -day living a lot more convenient. And one of the most inconvenient parts of our day is the cleanup. And these three devices are the basics of what you need to take your home cleaning to the next level. Let's start with the one you've already met. This little guy is the Eufy RoboVac G30 Hybrid, which is actually one of my favorite robot vacuums in the market. Robot vacuums are designed to automatically clean the floor using vacuums. And what I like about this one in particular is that it can mop too. So, how does it work? Every robot vacuum is basically a vacuum with wheels. These brushes guide dust and small items toward the vacuum, and everything the RoboVac picks up is stored in this container. They also have sensors that tell them where they're going. You can find them here, where they're tracking your floor, and here, where they're tracking things that they bump into. The sensor connects to a computer inside the vacuum, which tells it where to go. Whenever the vacuum bumps into something, the computer tells it to turn around and go somewhere else. But the real magic happens because it also has Wi-Fi. This lets me control the RoboVac from my phone and from my smart assistant. Using the Eufy RoboVac app on my phone, I can connect the vacuum to my PLTT home Wi-Fi network, which lets other devices communicate with it. This means that I can use my phone to activate the vacuum or even set a regular cleaning schedule. If I have a smart assistant, like this Google Home Mini I've got over here, I can even use voice commands. Check this out. Hey Google, let's clean the floors every day at 3 p.m. Okay, cleaning the floors every day at 3 p.m. What's really cool about robot vacuums is that many of them are self-charging. When the RoboVac's battery is low, for example, automatically it goes back to its charging station. Usually, I hide my charging station under something like a shelf or a desk. This way, people don't accidentally step on it, and it's out of reach for pets and children, for example. The RoboVac is best used for everyday cleaning talaga. At since automatic naman siya, you can really keep your floors dust and hair free. But for more heavy-duty cleaning though, you'll need something a little bit more powerful. I highly recommend getting a wireless vacuum like this Xiaomi Mi Vacuum Cleaner. G10. Going wireless lets you clean up harder to reach places, and if you have large rooms in your house, you won't need an extension cord to vacuum areas that aren't near any walls. Going wireless also means nothing gets in the way of those sweet dance moves. I personally like the Mi Vacuum because it's powerful enough to pick up 99.97% even the smallest bits of dust, and its battery gives you up to 65 minutes of continuous cleaning. Speaking of the battery, it only takes 2.5 hours to get a full charge. That means you can do heavy-duty cleaning without too much waiting. The display near the handle naman lets you monitor its battery life as well as the cleaning mode. Yung okay pa dito, it actually has a smart floor brush that can detect different types of flooring and then adjust its speed based on that. So, instead of forcing you to switch modes when you go from tiles to carpet, the vacuum can do that for you automatically. When we talk about cleaning our homes, we usually don't think about the biggest part of every home, the air inside. And that needs cleaning too. This is the Mi Air Purifier H3, which can filter particles in the air as small as 0.3 microns, which means it can remove small molds and bacteria from the air that you breathe. What I really like about this air purifier though is this. It's a high-precision laser PM sensor. When in automatic mode, it can actually measure the pollution in the air and then automatically adjust its settings to make sure you breathe the cleanest air possible. 
and it's also a smart device. So as long as I'm connected to the Wi-Fi network, ko, I can control it with the Mi Home app on my phone or with my smart assistant. With a robot vacuum, wireless vacuum, and smart air purifier, you'll have all the basics of smart home cleaning. And that's it for this episode of Smart Home 101. We hope that we gave you some ideas for your next upgrade. Subscribe to our channel for more videos like this and for other helpful videos about smart homes. We upload a new one every single Sunday, so hit that bell button to get notifications for hashtag NextUpgradeSundays. See you, neighbors.